Tuesday Cadre, Barber Dave here with Barber Dave's Barber Shop at Home for another shave for a Tuesday. Uh, as they say, the best laid plans uh, get screwed up. My plan today was to do my outside shave at Swar National Park, but things got out of hand this morning. I had a bunch of chores to do around the, the ranch, so didn't happen. However, there are, I am going to use some of the components that I was going to use in that shave. And the first one is, is the UA Cowboy Kyle 3D printed DE razor. Uh, it's got a new cap, so that's why I'm reviewing it. It's a little bit mellow of a cap. The first cap had a huge gap on the uh, blade and it was very, very aggressive. So we're going to try that. And then the big thing today is the Gray Dog Tucson uh, Choya and Black Walnut Brush. And it's got a 26 millimeter uh, super high density or high mountain white uh, badge or not that is in the hybrid. So it's not a fan, it's not a bulb, it's right in between. And this thing got huge and it gelled pretty good. Uh, and then for our soap, keeping with the cactus theme, we're gonna go with SV Apuntia. And then of course, SV Apuntia aftershave. So, see what happens. The brush is huge. Um, and uh, just the initial test lathers have been pretty good. Um, this is really the first time I'm gonna use the brush um, on the face. The rest was to get the, the knot bloomed, but it doesn't take much to load, that's for sure. It splays nicely, it's soft. Um, very soft. And I'm sure it'll start releasing lather a little bit better as time goes on. Not quite as soft for a, for a high mountain Manchurian white, not as soft as uh, the SV brush, but pretty close. So we're hoping, and also I wanted to wait until my cactus straight razor got here to kind of theme the shave uh, for Swar National Park. So I'll probably do that next week. Builds lather real well, very comfortable brush. Um, so thanks Steve at Gray Dog. Certainly do appreciate it. It's kind of neat to have a brush that has elements from your own property in it. Still trying to get some Suaro stuff to send to him as well. Okay, let's give it a shot. Yeah, the blade blade feels much better on this uh, new new top cap. Still gets some blade feel, but nothing like that other one. Very comfortable, very lightweight razor. I would almost want to weight it a little bit because it is super light. Okay, there's the first pass. Definitely much more mild than the other the other cap, um, but nice, comfortable. Don't forget, everybody, we're going to have uh, another Zoom call this Wednesday. So we kind of went off the uh, schedule. 
And more than likely, for those of you that are in, involved with the SV brush, once I know a shipping date uh, that I'm going to get them, and I'm going to try to get you an update today or tomorrow, uh, we will have our Sunday, our normal Sunday Zoom call. We'll be dedicated to doing a, a lottery of sorts for the brushes. So we'll have all the brushes numbered, and then I'm going to randomly pick through a computer-generated random number picker um, who gets what brush. I would say this this new head on this, uh, Kyle, if you're listening, I would say it's medium aggressive. Still get good blade feel. And I think I mentioned this, I've got a brand new boss guide in it. Okay, there's pass two. There we go. It's a good razor. It will probably become my travel razor. And as is typical with SV, the lather is just tremendous. I think next week there'll be a new challenge coming out. I won't divulge what it is, but it should be hilarious for those people that want to take part in it. So would I recommend getting one of these uh, uh, DE, 3D printed DE razors from Kyle? Absolutely. Like I said, they're a little bit light, but I think I'm going to weight mine a little bit. But uh, fun, fun little DE to use. Mildly aggressive. I'd say along the same lines as a uh, red tip. Super speed, or maybe even an open cone crat, but very, very nice. Oh, yeah. Really, no cleanup really needed at all. So, let's see how the new razor did as far as the alum is concerned. Like I said, I only use that with new one. Nothing. Yeah, nothing. Good shave with that. So Kyle, good job. It uh, works wonderfully. I don't want to waste any of this soap, so I'm going to kind of use it as aftershave today. But unlike recent videos, I am going to plan on rinsing it rather than just wiping it off my face.
perfect shave. Not bad for a 3D razor. I like it. And that head is much better than the old one. Okay, we'll do some Apuntia aftershave. And then we'll follow that. Oh, the Apuntia is just such good stuff. That's why it's one of the tops. Okay, we'll do the talc and everything afterwards. That's it for my shave today, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, hope you have a great week. Um, and don't forget to come see us at theshavingcadre.com. That's www.theshavingcadre.com. Have a great day.